I know virtually nothing about this game, except for the fact that Tim Curry and Christopher Lloyd are in it. Anyway, let's watch the intro. Hey, look. Greg Scott. It's Christopher Lloyd. Sorry, Christopher Lloyd. Hello. Drew Blank? Yes. This is Dr. Stern's office. I'm calling to remind you about your dental appointment tomorrow uh, morning. Okay, I can... Mr. Blank? Yes? You've missed your last three appointments, Mr. Blank. Uh, yes, I know. I, I mean, I mean I, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm terribly sorry. I must have forgotten. It's only a filling, Mr. Mm. Blank. So you'll be here tomorrow, 10 a.m. sharp? I promise. I'll be so there to make up for all my missed appointments. I don't care what you do, Mr. Blank, as long as you don't forget again. Wow. What a bitch. Yes, yes, yes. I, I, I remember. I remember. All right, Drew. I'm sorry. Uh-oh. you remember, then why aren't you... Oh, whoops. Oh, I'm sorry, Maxine. I, 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 I thought you were... Oh, why aren't I what? Your meeting with Schmaltz, it started 10 minutes ago. <gasps> Chris Scott! I'm so dead. I have expected to say Chris Scott. Being late for a meeting with one's superiors was grounds for immediate dismissal. See that it doesn't happen again. Yes, sir, Mr. Schwartz. Oh, it's that guy from uh, yeah, then. Ferris sure Bueller's Day Off. This season marks the Bueller. 10th anniversary Bueller. of the Fluffy Fluffy Bun Bun Show. Frankly, we've milked this formula long enough. Bun Bun needs a boost. It needs revitalizing. It needs a shot in the arm. A shot in the arm, yes, sir. Sure does. And since Bun Bun's your creation, I want you to personally administer this revitalizing shot. Thank you, sir. Here's how I see it. We create a big batch of happy, cute bunnies to share the spotlight with Bun Bun. It's an all-new show, and we call it Fluffy and Friends. After all, if one bun can carry a company like Sam Schmaltzing for 10 years, a whole truckload of things has got to be a gold mine. 24 carat. <laughs> Get it? Yes, terrific idea. That is exactly what the show needs, uh, more bunnies. Of course it's a terrific idea. That's why I get paid the big bucks. That was an obvious... Uh, well, what are you waiting for? Uh, Go make. Sarcasm oh, there, one he didn't get thing. it. Uh, yes, sir. I want the new characters on my desk first thing tomorrow morning. And this time, don't be late. Tomorrow morning. First thing, yes. You know, I've never seen that okay. Ben Stein character smile once. Rabbits. I'm More sure he's human. Friendly. Rabbits. Rabbits, that. Nice things. Rabbits that don't even care. Shit. Flux, really? You mean like flux, flux capacitors? I, mean, I feel like they're, they're making Funny. references to Back to the Future for some reason. Uh, must focus on bunnies. Must focus on bunnies. <sighs> Sucked in. 
No place like home, or do whatever it takes to get me out of here. Well, I guess if it means that much to you. So, you mean you do know how to get me home? Hell no! I have problems finding my own way home, but I do know a guy who might be able to help. So, you see, King Hugh, your wonderfulness, Drew needs to get back home. Can you help him, can you, huh? Oh, dear, dear, dear. I'm so sorry for all the trouble you've been through. Well, uh, of course I'll help you find your way home. But Thank there's you. a catch. Thank you, your majesty. There's a catch, though. But uh, there's just one teensy-weensy little problem. Of course. Let me explain. Of course. We are here. Qtopia. Hey, that's where I live. That's where I live, right there. <laughs> Jamie do. It's kind of like an offshore asylum, but to me, it's always been home. Okay. <laughs> Back to you, your benevolence. <laughs> yes. As I was saying, we are here in Qtopia, home of the happy, helpful Qtopians. And, of course, they're good and just king. It's me. We <laughs> were all so very, very happy until we fell under attack by a very wicked man, Count Nefarious. Played Red. by Tim Curry. Don't even have to look at him. <laughs> Who would? Nefarious is ruler of the Malevolands and its dismal denizens. He has perfected a Malevolator. Hey, that's the thing that took a shot at me! It's a terrible flying weapon of Nefarious's own invention. The Malevolator shoots a powerful ray that corrupts everything it touches, turning all that is sweet and pleasant into all that is sinister. Hey, that looks cool, actually. Ugly. So, what? I'm afraid oh, that's probably not the reaction. We really have. need you to help us before we can help you. But how could I possibly help? My Brave spies have stolen the blueprints for Nefarious's bad, bad machine. My royal engineer is using these plans to build a cutifier. Ew. A device which will reverse the damage Nefarious has done. Mr. Drew, please. I need you to help us finish the cutifier so that we can end Nefarious's reign of terror and make the world a happy place. And then, I promise you, I will do everything in my power to help you get home. Don't worry, your benevolence. We'll save you. Won't we? Mr. Drew? Sure, your highness. I, 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 I'd be happy to help. Great stuff. Absolutely splendid. Thank you, friend. You can't possibly understand what this means to me and my kingdom. Before you leave the castle, please stop by my lab. Well, it sounds so fair. I mean, can show you the cutifier. He did try to destroy Toontown and Hooper and Roger Rabbit. Utopia is counting on you. So that's the intro. Alright, on to the game. Oh, please tell me don't watch the intro again. Oh, god damn it. Really? Uh, I want the new ca Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've already seen this. Okay, cool. Uh, there's the game start. Uh, so let's see how this game works exactly. Okay, so uh, I guess okay. That's 
We pick up the... Okay, where is our inventory items and shit? Uh, okay, so that's how you walk. Okay. Alright, let's check this cabinet. I here. can't just yank it open. Oh, well. Oh! There's a hole in the side of the cupboard. Okay, I gotta open it somehow. Now, how do we, uh... How do we look at... Uh, go through this doorway, I guess. Hello! Hello. We're looking for the Royal Engineer. Really? I'm looking for my glasses. Oh. Well, if you see the Engineer, would you tell him we're looking for him? I will. But he's rather preoccupied right now. He's lost his glasses. Uh -huh. Now, where can they be? Uh-huh. Okay. Where are they? Uh-huh. It's a trash can. So's the floor, apparently. <laughs> Another of the engineer's useful inventions, no doubt. I can't see a thing! Another of the engineer's useful inventions, no doubt. I don't like that you can't... Um, when you click on something, you can't stop clicking on it. And so that's a weird gadget that's that. I guess we'll talk to him. Uh... Excuse me. I don't mean to be rude, but I'm afraid I don't have time to chit-chat right now. Finding my glasses is a tippy-top priority. All right, we gotta find this guy. Hey, glasses, glasses. We gotta find this guy's glasses somehow. All right. Uh, is there anything we can take? Doesn't look like it. Uh, let's go to this doorway then. I wonder what's through that doorway on the right. That's the tippy-top secret area. Please. Stay out! Oh, okay. Well then, we won't go in there then. Okay. Or maybe we'll have to distract him somehow. Alright. Um. Okay, we'll go... That's the throne room. We've already been there. Then we go through that door, or we can go upstairs. Let's see what's upstairs on this side. I don't know if we can go this way or not. Let's find out. Can we go this way? No, we can't. Okay. Okay, but we can go in here, so let's go in here. Let's see what we can do in here. Okay. What the hell is this? Footman, really? Okay. Excuse me. Could we have a word with you? Certainly. Which word would you like? <laughs> May I recommend? Goodbye. Okay. Key Hughes sure has a lot of trophies. Well done, sir. A keen observation. However, if I may be blunt, I find dusting a trifle difficult whilst engaged in such witty and insightful conversation. Oh. So it's all the same to you. I suggest you gentlemen be on your way. Hey, wait a second. What kind of a butler are you anyway? Yeah. For your information, no kind of butler at all. Are you blind, sir? What? Look at him. I think he's a footman. What? So you telling me a butler would be a great big... Right. <laughs> <laughs> we were just talking to a bird downstairs. He seemed a little flustered. Ah, you've had the misfortune of meeting Bric-a-Brac, our royal engineer. Bric-a-Brac seems to be having a bit of a problem. Allow me to go out on a limb, sir. Rickabrack has lost his glasses. Yes, that's right. Uh, I don't suppose he has checked his pocket. Oh, I didn't ask. Hmm. Well, while I find the troubles of our engineer most fascinating, sir, in future I would prefer to focus my energies on more important matters, yeah. such as the condition of my master's trophies. Okay. This must be a tough time for King Hugh. Nefarious on the loose, Utopians getting struck down left and right, dust collecting on his trophies. Oh, <laughs> indeed. It's just terrible to see His Royal Highness so unhappy. Every night, I wind his precious royal music box. It begins to play its sweet little lullaby. And only then can my poor king sleep. Sweet dreams to your royal snookums, I softly whisper, as I tuck his highness in. Huh? <clears throat> Footman's duties, you wouldn't understand. Uh-huh. 
So what are all these trophies for, anyway? Aside from dusting. <laughs> all sorts of things. First place in the Tribute to Hugh essay contest. Most likely to succeed. Best King of Qtopia. Best King of Qtopia? Yes, that one's quite an honor. It was bestowed by the king himself. Don't you think it's just a little bit funny that the king has proclaimed yeah, himself? Yeah, isn't that a little strange? Best king? Funny? May I inquire how many times you have been so honored? Well, none. But exactly. <laughs> so please, show our sovereign a little respect. And might I suggest, in future, you reserve jocularity for a more suitable subject matter. Such uh -huh. as your combined IQ. Hey! Time for us to shove off. Then please, by all means, shove off, sir. Wow, you're an asshole. Can we use him on the footman? Here. Flux, distract the footman while I do something. No can do, Drew. Okay. Oh, shit. What do we need to do? Oh, the watering can trophy. Huh. Please don't touch the trophies, gentlemen. I've just spent the last week dusting them. Hmm. Well, maybe we can... Hmm. Flux, could you snatch that trophy while the footman isn't looking? If all my years of experience have taught me one thing, it's... Not how to steal trophies out from under the watchful eye of a humorless footman. Uh oh. Huh. Flux, distract the footman while I do something. No can do, Drew. Well, you're useless. Uh, how the hell are we supposed to get that? Because I'm pretty sure we got to get that water and can somehow for some reason. Because I'm sure it's important. Uh, all right. Well, I guess we can't do anything right now. Oh, let's leave him another. Okay. <sighs> okay. Well, we can't do anything in there. Let's uh, see if if that guy's if that footman's statement was correct about the guy's glasses being in his pocket. I mean, of all the most ludicrous things, that can't possibly be true. Let's see. Brick a brack, by any chance, are your glasses in your pocket? I had no idea. I wish I had them right now. I think what Drew means is look in your pocket. Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> They're in there, yeah. My glasses! You're kidding. I wonder who put them there. Uh... Say, do I know you? I'm Drew, and he's Flux. We're friends of King Hugh. We've come to help you with a cutifier. Wonderful! Welcome to Team Happy! <laughs> Let me show you what I've been working on. Okay. Gentlemen, this is the blueprint for Nefarious's Malevolator! Now then, you see the 12 things installed inside the ship's deck? Yeah. The whistles, the dagger, and whatnot. Well, mm -hmm. they power Nefarious's Malevolation Beam. We need 12 things to power the beam on our machine. Of course but we do. so far, I've only been able to find one. Well, I guess a scavenger hunt for the missing parts shouldn't take too long. We already have the blueprint. At least we know what we need to get. Not that easy. Use the same 12 things, get another malevolation beam, see? What we need are 12 different things. Ah. Things of a different nature. Of course. Things that will produce the reverse effect. Oh, no. right. You said you had one thing that worked? Why, yes I do. Let's take another look, see, at the blueprint. Okay. The one thing that seems to work is sugar. It works when I put it right there, where the spice is in the fairy machine. But why? I haven't a clue. Well, Brick and Rack, we better go. The sooner we get those missing parts, the better for all of us. Wait, you'll be needing the Malevolator blueprint for reference. Do 
Now where is it got to? It's in your uh, hat. You're still holding it, Wing Commander. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that reminds me. I want to give you something that may help. A bottomless bag to carry all the parts in. Ah, uh, inventory, basically. Thank you, bric a -brac. Yeah. Splendid. And please, feel free to come back here anytime. We can install different things into the cutifier to see if they work. Or we can just talk. Okay? Okay. Thank you, new friends, and good luck! I wonder if Chrissy... Let's look at the bottomless bag, what we got? Yeah, see, this is our inventory down here. Yeah, see? The Malevolator. Okay. Spice, he said sugar works good with that. Uh... In a ball. Bolts. Needles. I bet nuts would work as an opposite there. And I bet that pepper would be a good substitute there. And... Heart. Well, we probably want something in the opposite of that. I'm not sure what it'd be. Maybe a diamond? Uh, club? You know? Uh, stripes? Well, I don't know if that would be. Maybe dots? A dagger? I'm not sure what would be the opposite of that. A bow? Maybe an arrow? Because that's like the opposite. Well, no, it's not the opposite. It's, it's, it's uh... Uh, whistles, maybe bells. Okay. Yeah, so they're not really similar. I mean, they're not uh, different. They're the similar, but they're almost the same. So, like spice, that's why the sugar works there. Salt, pepper would work there. Rock, probably paper, because <laughs> you know rock, paper, and scissors. You know. All right. Needles, I'm not really sure. Well, anyway, so now we've got our inventory now. This bag, basically, so we can carry all our junk in it. Alright. It's in here. <laughs> Wait for me! So the new parts go in those compartments around the cutifier's deck? Yes, that's right. When you've installed all the components, you simply press that big red button to run the machine. If there are any problems, the computer will let us know. Okay. Got it. Okay, so we've got to, uh, yeah. Okay, cool. Right, let's find us some paper. So I can test my theory out. It's a trash can. It's a trash can. Well, can't it's we look? It's a trash can. I guess we can't look in it. Alright, fine. Okay. I mean, I wonder if we can put that tr that uh, water can in there now that we've got an inventory. Let's see. Probably won't let us, but we can see. We can try it anyway. Let's try picking up Flux. I have to try and take the water and can't trip you Flux, can you snatch that trophy while the footman isn't looking? If all my years of experience have taught me one thing, it's not how to steal trophies out from under the watchful eye of a humorless footman. So no. Okay then. Fine. Because we've got to get that water and can. <laughs> I've worn my toes to the bone dusting those. Please keep your hands off them. Alright, fine. Well, let's leave here then. What do we need to do? Uh, I suppose we can talk to him by then. Look, there's a message hanging from the doorknob. Do not disturb. Busy formulating alternative plans for saving my kingdom. Thanks. Oh, okay. So we can't go in there then. Okay, fine. Well, let's check this door then. Is this door unlocked? The door is locked. Do you think King Hugh wants us to stay out of there? Heck no! I've always viewed a locked door as an invitation. 
Okay, but well we gotta find a key then. Right. I guess we'll go outside then. Let's explore the outdoors. Huh, who are you? Hi guys, I'm Drew Blank, and this is my friend. We're building a machine that's going to save Qtopia. We're secretly building a machine that's going to save Qtopia. Oh, jeez. These are the palace guards. You think they don't know what's going on? Building a machine? Qtopia? <laughs> Never mind. So, what exactly do you guys do around here? Let's show him, Sparky. Okie dokie, Chipper. Two, three, four. Bippity bip bip bippity pa! Bip boop bip boop bippity pa! Ya da da da! Diddly da! Ya da diddly diddly da! Skiddly diddly dippity do! Oh. Oops! Yeah, oops. That's our little hello dance! It even has a message! That's right! It means hello! Here's hoping it made your trip to the palace today just a tiny bit brighter! Yeah! Uh, thanks, guys! Can I have that key? You don't have to thank us! Your smile is payment enough. Can we have that key? Boy, it sure has been a tough day, hasn't it, Flux? Yes. Oh, we, we sure could use some cheering up. Mayday, mayday! Our friends have the frownies. Quick, the dance. Oh, no. Wait, it hasn't been that tough. Two, three, four. Bippity, bip, bip, bippity, ba. Bip, boop, bip, boop, bippity, ba. Yeah. Oh, looks like the little fellows dropped something. Too bad. Good. There, we got the key. Alright. Sorry about that, folks. As you can see, we now have a key. And I bet that unlocks that door in the hall. So let's see if it does. Yoink! Or we can try it in that cupboard. There's a hole in the side of the cupboard. Hmm. Let's try this key. That's not a keyhole. Never mind. Let's try it in this door, then. There we go. Well, there's one problem to solve. And 1,110 to go. Of yes. course, that's only an estimate. <laughs> oh, okay. Let's see what we can find in here to get. Oh, what's this? Music box. Doink. Ah, oh, we got some music box. Let's see what else is in these drawers. What we got in here? Uh, oh god, is this a puzzle? It is a puzzle, isn't it? Yep. We're we supposed to do something with these drawers, I wonder? Okay, we opened everything. Are we supposed to close them all? I wonder. No. Okay, let's... Okay, let's, uh... We closed them all. What did it do? Not me, I don't know. If only getting back to my world was as simple as walking through this looking glass. Remember, open up. Don't shut down. Go right in. Don't be left out. Sounds uh, like some sort of inspirational note. 
I get it. I get it. Okay. So what did it say again? Remember, open up. Don't shut down. Go right in. Don't be left out. Okay, so... Open up. Go right in. Okay, I'm gonna have to figure this out next time. All right, let's save. How do we save? How do we save anyway, I wonder? Oh, that's out, okay. Uh, what is that thing that is? Save. Play. That's not the save button. Where is the save button? All these switches do. Yeah. Okay, that's not helping. Play. Oh, okay, that's how we save. All right, cool. Save here. Anyway, hope you enjoyed this video. Stay tuned for more Toonstruck. Stay tuned for future Let's Plays. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comments. And I will see you next time. But for now, bye-bye.